This week is back and what makes it even more special that it's a hundred years of celebration of our great borough. Today for the kickoff celebration we got to meet two of the very special honorees being inducted into the Bronx Walk of Fame. This marks a very special year for the Bronx as it turns 100. To kick off the celebration, the event was held at the Gun Hill Brewery. This is the first brewery opened in the Bronx since the Prohibition. Borough President Ruben Diaz Jr. says that this is an exciting time to be in office. It's an amazing time to be the Borough President. I am blessed. I am honored. Today is a day where we kick off Bronx Week, where we show the world and showcase what's the very best of our borough, whether it's cuisine, whether it's music, personality like Swiss Beats and David Zayas, people who have conquered the world. Two of the five honorees to be honored were introduced to Bronx Heights. Most who were fans enjoyed meeting Grammy Award producer Swiss Beats and actor most known for his role on Dexter, David Zayas. Both proud Bronx Heights were happy to be a part of the celebration. Swiss Beats, who is involved in the development for the Bronx Charter School of the Arts, spoke about the importance of giving back. Man, for me to come back to my community and support a school is like a big step to what I really want to do is open up my own school in the Bronx. Um, so it's a nice warm up, amazing kids we have there. And it, and it shows, you know, it shows hope, it shows growth. And the Bronx, the Bronx is the best. You know, it's important for anybody, whether they're from, to come back and give back. Um, you know, I learned a lot in the Bronx. You know, I learned about life. I learned about family. I learned about friendship. Um, I had wonderful times in the Bronx. Um, and positive times in the Bronx. Always been proud to be from the Bronx. When they ask me, everywhere you go on the internet, you put my name in, it says I'm from the Bronx. And uh, there's nothing wrong with that. It's something that should be proud of. And, uh, and it's, it's exciting to be on, on a list of other people that have been other amazing artists or business people or medical people that have been included in this Walk of Fame. Just to be included in that list in this year's and in the past years is, is, is pretty special. Attendees also got a taste of the different restaurants and bakeries we have here in the Bronx. We needed a good sushi in the Bronx and in the South Bronx. And uh, we went and opened a good sushi spot in the Bronx. Uh, people coming from Manhattan, because they um, telling us that we have the best sushi. Well, we hand make these pretzels. We hand roll them and lie dip them in a very traditional German method. And we bake them every day. And so when you get them, they're extremely fresh. And we make some pretzel varieties that you can't find any place else. Well, we're really happy to be part of Bronx Week. We wanted to name the company after the borough. We wanted to align ourselves with this place and we want to grow with this place as well. We think there's so much potential here and the borough is an awesome place to be doing business. We're very happy that we came here. Of course, you couldn't leave the event without treating yourself to some Coco Helado Icy. Even Swiss Beats had to stop at the Icy stand. All right, that was just a glimpse of what's going to be happening for this 10-day celebration. To make sure that you don't miss the beat, log on to ilovethebronx.com. And for all of you social media heads, make sure and tag all of your pictures using the hashtag Bronx100. For BronxNet, I'm Bronca Guiti.